Hey all, Constantin here. In today's video we'll take a look at the input of type checkbox. So, imagine you want to create a form on a website where users can select multiple options. For example, let's say you want to ask them which hobbies they enjoy. Reading, playing games or watching movies. Uh, to do this, uh, you can use the input of type checkbox. A checkbox is like a small box that user can click to select or deselect an option. Uh, where checkbox, uh, when checkbox is selected, a check mark appears inside the box. So let's dive into the code and see how it looks like. I created a form already with a button of type submit. And let's add our checkbox inputs. As you know from the previous videos, uh, when we are using checkboxes, um, when we use any inputs, not only checkbox, uh, we are using labels to name uh, the input. And uh, we can also put uh, the input inside the label. So we can do it in this way. Inside the label we are putting input and let's give it a type of checkbox. Uh, the name hobby and the value uh, reading. So uh, this value will be sent uh, when we uh, will submit the form and the value which user, user will see on the screen we are writing here inside the label tag so we'll write reading and as you see we have a checkbox of reading and let's create two more label playing games and let's put an input here and uh, please pay attention that when we are creating like the group of checkboxes the name should be the same because this is the parameter uh, which will be associated uh, with the user choice when we will submit the form and let's set uh, the third one watching uh, movies same name hobby and the value just movies and as you see we have three options now to choose so if you want them all you can click them all if you for example like just reading and watching movies you can click only two of them and let's check how it will work when we will submit the form. So let's open the developer tools, hit F12 on the keyboard. And we will like, will fake the submitting of the form because we have this method post and action of submit PHP. We don't have the script, but the submission of the form will appear in the developer tools. So when we will choose reading, only reading and click submit. Here is our submission of the form. And in payload we can see that we have chosen only reading as a hobby. And let's try to do something else. Let's choose reading and watching movies and let's submit. 
And as you see in the payload, now we have two hobbies, reading and movies. I hope this explanation will help you. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask me in the section comment. And uh, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel. Cheers and happy learning!